Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. So today guys, I'm going to be sharing with you guys how to start up this top business here in Nigeria. This business is the most profitable business that you can ever think of because it's always on a high demand and any business that is of a high demand is a very profitable business here in Nigeria. So if you're somebody that is looking for business to start, business that will be giving you daily, weekly, monthly or even yearly profit, then I will advise that you go into full stop business and start making a lot of money for yourself. The reason why this business is a very profitable business is because it's always on a high demand. People will always eat. We will always get hungry at some point and that will make us get full stop. And because of that, the, as you are getting full stop, people that are selling it are making money. So that is why this business is very profitable here in Nigeria. And the good thing about this business is that anybody can do it male or female can go into this business and make money as long as you are willing to start up this business as long as you are willing to go into this business that you are going to make a lot of money for yourself and in this kind of business you can either start as a wholesaler or as a retailer it all depends on your capital how do you start up this full stop business first you have to decide the type of full stop business that you want to go into because you have a lot of full stop that you can actually go into you have selling of rice selling of beans, you have a lot of them. You can as well combine them as well or choose a particular uh, food product that you'll be selling and you are good to go. So once you are able to decide on the type of food that you want to go into, then you have to set up your capital. Your capital will be what your capital will determine how big you want to go into this business. If you want to go into this business in a bigger way or in a smaller way, it all depends on your capital. Once you are able to set up your capital, then it's not time for you to look for a good space for you to start up this business. Let's say you want to start it in a big way. I will advise that you look for a shop in the major road. You know, location is very important when it comes to any business. There are some locations that when you look for, you will be glad that you did because you will be selling massively. And why there are some locations that you will not be selling, instead of people be selling, people will be coming and asking for credit. So avoid that kind of location. Avoid it and look for a location that has major people that you'll be seeing like major road. Major road is a good example for this kind of business. Closer to the market is also a better place for this kind of business. Then inside the market is also a good place for this kind of business. Then there are some streets, some, some busy streets, some residence streets also a good place for this kind of business so once you are able to secure a shop in this kind of business then it's not time for you to start buying your food stuff start buying your product let's say you want to go into general sales like selling of rice beans plant egg, rice beans pack oil gun oil something stuff like that then you must start to locate for where you can start buying this kind of product majority of the people that sell this thing in their local market, there are usually people that distribute this product to them. So you make us research, ask questions and ask so that they will guide you or they will show you the place that they normally go and buy. If you are in Delta State now, I can direct you to where you can get your stuff. But for other places, I don't really know. So they go to this place, they buy this in bulk take it to their shop to go and sell and they will make a lot of money for themselves especially those that are, se are selling these products in the major road they sell a lot they will make a lot of money for themselves so once you are able to get how to start buying this young product once you are able to locate how to start buying them then equip yourself your shop make it look attractive you can create a signboard for people to know that you are into full stop business now and start selling but if you don't want it that way you don't want to rent a shop for it you can also buy start buying food stuff like melon like bono seed like palm oil we package them and start posting them online you will be selling you'll be making massive money from this business when you buy melon you repackage it in a syllable nylon post them online from then you can even start exporting this product to other countries and start making a lot of money for yourself that is if you don't want to rent a shop for you you don't want to start renting a shop or start going to the shop to go and sell let's say you are a worker 
and you want to go into this business or you you have other things that you are doing so you don't have time to rent a shop and still there to start selling this product what you have to do is look for a hot selling product like mellow like organic seed like locust beans like dried the wedge dried bitter leaves stuff like that package them in a syllable nylon and start posting it on your social media you will make a lot of money from this business especially facebook marketplace or you can as well buy planting put it in the sun to dry properly then grind it into powder repackage it and start selling you can even start distributing these products abroad i've made a video on how to get the nigerian food stock buyers abroad so if you want to start exporting these products you can as well watch that video it will guide you on how to get customers that will be willing to buy this product from you in other country and start making a lot of money for yourself. So this business is a business that you don't need to do much for you to start making sales and you will make a lot of money for yourself. So guys, please if you are not subscribed to this channel, please try and do so. Try and subscribe to this YouTube channel if you have not subscribed. Click on the notification bell icon so that you will notified whenever I upload a new video to my returning subscriber. Thank you for always stopping by to watch my video. You guys go. Bye for now.